Hey, what is up, guys? It's your boy Scooter back again with some Samsung Galaxy Note rumors and leaks. So, not too long ago on June the 24th, Evan Blast, which is a pretty well known guy for rumors and leaks for most electronics and stuff, uh, tweeted this out saying this will most likely be the new logo for the Galaxy Note 7. As you can see, uh, it's not going to be the 6. Look like they're going to go ahead and skip on to the 7 to put it in line with the the S series which is the S7 and the S6 and all the different other ones as well and then also I said that in the last video I'll be sure to put like the link or annotation to it somewhere in the screen somewhere and then also over here it says that they're gonna be an iris scanner an iris scanner you'll be able to scan your eyes to unlock your phone which is a little crazy and really futuristic and then here is a couple more specifications that he tweeted out as far as a 5.7 inch screen a 64 gigabyte internal storage 12 megapixel camera which they probably take from the s7 and then a 5 megapixel front facing camera and then the different color options will probably be black silver and blue as well now going over to tech radar um, they are I want to say they are going off of what um, Evan Blass is this guy that they're, they're using him as a source I believe because it says it right here the note 6 skipping name is F future forward that will include an iris scanner notable phone leaker Evan Blass so they're they're using him so this is probably what the design will look like uh, for whenever they debut the Galaxy Note 7. So a little bit more about the iris scanner is that you'll probably be able to unlock your phone with your eyes, which I'm not exactly sure how long that would take, but to me it'd be quicker to just go ahead and use the fingerprint scanner and then you'll unlock your phone a whole lot faster versus trying to hold the phone up to your eye, trying to unlock your phone. In my opinion, I think that just take too long to do it. So it's cool. It's a nice, cool idea that they're trying to do, but I think that just take too long to try to unlock a phone. So some of the other specifications that they were still going off of is that it's six gigabytes of RAM still, 64 gigabytes of internal storage, and then also debuting the new Snapdragon 823 processor. So and then also as well, they're not sure about the removable battery since it may be an all glass phone. So they're not sure if it'll be a removable battery and then also the battery will probably have a size of 4200 milliamp hours and like I said the, tw the about the camera and stuff coming from the S7 as well and then also um, the release date is still set for August the 2nd and that is pretty much it I just wanted to give you guys a quick little update on the Galaxy Note 7 or yeah the Note 7 since it's not going to be the 6 anymore but that's pretty much it and I'll catch you guys in the next one.